everybody, it's Claire. Thanks so much for stopping by. Today I have a really exciting video on some of my favorite ways on how to look expensive on a budget. Now I use these tips every single day for myself. I'm definitely a gal who's on a budget who wants to still look good. But I also want to give a shout out to Alexandra here on YouTube who I am doing a collab with today. I have been absolutely in love with her channel lately. She has made my life and my home decor life so much better, giving so much inspiration with her home life and just lifestyle videos. She's adorable and she has been watching my channel for a really long time so it's so cool to collaborate with someone who's been so supportive of me and I just really can't wait for you guys to meet her. Here's a little bit about Alexandra. Hello guys, I'm Alexandra Buter and on my channel I share videos on organization and cleaning routines, home decor, lifestyle, beauty, and more. And my goal is to provide you with inspiration for your everyday life. After you watch Claire's video, definitely check out the link below for my channel and come say hi. I would love to have you and I will see you guys there. Bye. Make sure you guys check her out, give her some love, subscribe to her channel if you aren't already. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into my top ways on how to look expensive on a budget. The first tip is to wear monochromatic colors. By doing this, you're gonna look like you've elongated yourself. You're gonna look like you tried harder than you actually did. Just simply by focusing on black all the way down, white, I especially love those two for looking expensive because you can't really go wrong with that and everyone has black and white in their closet. Make sure you're sticking to a black top and bottom that is in the same tone. That will also really help your look look more expensive. Number two is to steam your clothes. Now, I just got a steamer last year and it has changed my life. I spent maybe $20 at Bed Bath & Beyond and got a little handheld steamer and I love it. It transforms the way my blouses look, my t-shirts, just by quickly going over it. And I love that you can hang it up. Just do it so quickly. It's so much different than ironing. It makes everything look nice and pressed like you just got it from the dry cleaner, except you did it at home. It takes two minutes to do. I even sometimes will just do a bunch of shirts at once so that they're ready for the week. It's a great little Sunday activity. They look so nice and fresh honestly elevates your look a lot. Tip number three is one of my favorites and it is such a game changer. You could do this with any t-shirt, any sweater, is simply tucking in your shirt. By tucking it in just in the front area, it looks really polished. It does something with your eye too, just really focusing in, it pulls you in together. And it's just one of those quick things that you can do that really you look put together and you look more expensive. Now, if you're not into the front tuck, then this one is for you. Go ahead and add a belt. Something about a belt is also gonna mimic that effect of the front tuck where you're kind of just cinching in that waistline. It kind of just breaks up your outfit a little bit. And I think it just looks so nice, even with a plain t-shirt, a belt, and then jeans. It's really that simple. This next one is so funny to me because it's really true. When I see bloggers have the drape jacket over their shoulders, Something about them looks so elevated and expensive to me. So that's my next tip to you guys because I find it to look really expensive and like you're trying harder than you actually did. I don't usually do this because I kind of feel like I look funny when I do it, but whenever I see girls do it, they look expensive to me. In fact, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below what your favorite way to look expensive is on a budget. The next one is a no brainer and this is probably my favorite tip is to wear a bold lip. A bold lip is just really rich. It makes a statement. I absolutely love a nice bold shade of red. Every time I do that, I get a compliment on it. I look like I tried harder than I did, especially if I don't feel like I'm very put together or that I don't really feel my best. I will throw on a red lip and it automatically makes me feel more confident, more expensive. So it's just a really nice thing to have in your makeup bag or in your purse. My next tip is crucial and it is to wear structured pieces. So my personal favorite is wearing structured bags. Now this one that I bought is super cheap and I got it because I love how it had those hard edges and it looks a lot more expensive than it actually was. So focus on that when you're shopping. Also with blazers or any sort of nice blouses, having a little bit more form fitting just really is gonna elevate your look, make you look like you tried a lot harder than you actually did. I know that I've said that so many times in this video. The next one is simple and it is adding a watch. Now a watch can be a game changer with looking more expensive. It's such a statement piece, but not overbearing. You're not wearing a huge crazy necklace. Something about a watch though just makes you look really put together, really expensive. You can even switch out some of the bands of your watches to play up your look and change it up. Next is to wear big sunglasses. There's something about big sunglasses that just makes someone look more expensive. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like 
kind of this mysteriousness behind the glasses. The bigger the glasses, the bigger the structure, go for it. It'll make you look way more expensive. Last tip is to keep it simple. When you think expensive, you think you need to be loud with prints and, and maybe just crazy handbags, but it's not true at all. If you just keep it to neutrals and just really keep having pieces that fit you well, you're going to look expensive. You just want to make sure that you're putting them together well and you're not overthinking it really just stick to neutrals. That will be your best bet. You can really put together so many beautiful looks with just a neutral palette, keeping it simple and not overthinking it. I hope you all enjoyed those tips on how to look more expensive on a budget. These are a lot of tips that I use every day to look more expensive, to feel more expensive. The way you will look your best is if you feel your best. So I want to give you guys all those tools to really just be able to embrace your inner confidence and feel so good when you step out the door. If you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button to see more videos from me and also the notification bell so I'm in your inbox each week. Also make sure to check out Alexandra's video which I will link down in the description box and right here. Thank you all so much for joining me here as always and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care, bye!